Hi, you're very welcome back to Flinner's Folk Songs. Today we're going to do a very famous folk song called The Irish Rover. Uh, lots of people have recorded it. The Dubliners did it. The Clancy Brothers, whom I usually go to for the definitive version, they did it. The Pogues did it. It's a, really a drinking song. It's kind of a crazy song. The lyrics don't mean anything whatsoever. And it's very simple. There are only three chords in it, although you can do a slightly different version. I'll come back to that later. Now I'm going to do it in G formation because I think that's usually the best way and uh, I'm singing it actually in, in the key of A but it'll be in G formation so there's just three chords like I said there's G there's C and there's D and I will do the first verse and the last verse and you can get the lyrics of it here so here we go the Irish Rover in the year of our Lord, 1806, we set sail from the sweet home of Cork. And we were sailing away with the cargo bricks for the Grand City Hall in New York. We'd a elegant craft, she was raped for a nap. And oh, how the trade winds drove her. She withstood several blasts. She had straightforward version of the song like I said it's a drinking song you could if you wanted to embellish it slightly by putting say an E minor and an A minor absolutely no necessity I'll show you what I mean briefly in the year of our Lord 1806 we set sail from the sweet just makes it a little bit more musical but like I said there's absolutely no um, reason for you to have to do that because this is a song that one sings late at night when everyone has had a few drinks and everyone is just in the mood to let fly okay now like I said you can get the lyrics right here and if you want to contact me the email address is brianflynn707 at gmail.com that's brianflynn707 at gmail.com and don't forget, we'd love it if you like and especially subscribe here. I'll be back in a week or two with another one. Thanks a million for watching. Take care.